Yo, what is going on everyone? Guiding Light here back with another Fortnite video and in this one the brand new Predator challenges have finally gone live which means we can finally unlock the Predator skin. So in this video I'll be showing you guys how to complete the challenge. In order to unlock him what you need to do is actually go and defeat the brand new Predator boss. Now this boss will only spawn in one location and there's also only going to be one boss per lobby. So keep that in mind you might have to do this a few tries and if you guys remember from back in the previous seasons these challenges can get quite annoying. Now, if you want to help me out, you can use my code Guiding Light in the item shop. If you just press the support a creator button and then put in that code, it will help me out. So I do appreciate everyone that does that. Other than that, though, guys, let's jump right in, into this video. Now, in order to kill Predator, you will have to go to the Stronghold. This is the only place that he will spawn. But I do know the exact spawn point, so you're going to have a little bit of an advantage over everyone else. Keep in mind, though, guys, there's literally like 40, 50, 60 people dropping here at a time. You're going to see just how many people are trying to complete this challenge here in just a second. So it is really, really annoying, and you're going to have to really give it a few tries. So the best way to get this one done is to try to be the first person to land. As you can see, there's over 30 people here, so I didn't even really try to take any of these people out. There's really no point in trying to kill anyone, because as soon as you kill one or two people... You're either going to be so weak that you then can't kill Predator or that somebody else is going to come and third party you and just put one bullet in you. So the best thing that you can do in order to make give you the best chances of actually defeating Predator is to kind of just lay low for the first 30 seconds or so. Let all these people clear themselves out. If anyone rushes you, obviously try to take them out. But you don't want to start any gunfights. In fact, what you really want to do is try to get max health if you can because the Predator boss it has a bunch of health as well on top of having to deal with all of these players. So, I'll show you guys the exact location which the Predator boss spawns in, but those are just my tips and tricks before we got into that to try to give you guys a better chance. Keep in mind, guys, that Predator is going to have a ridiculous amount of health, and on top of that, you're going to have to put like six full auto clips into him. Now, I didn't even mention the best part about this boss, and the boss is actually invisible, so just that's going to be pretty nice as well, trying to defeat him. But either way, guys, if you come over here by the Mysterious Pod or by the big stealthy word on the minimap, this is where he likes to spawn. As you can see, this is actually the boss here right in front of me. I'm going to slow this clip down so that you guys can actually see what's going on. But that's the best thing about this boss, guys. He's actually invisible. So not only do you have to fight the 150 people that land here, but you also have to find an invisible boss and then find a way to kill him as well while he's running around all over the place. So he will stay invisible the entire fight, and he does have a melee weapon that's going to hit you for about 25 or 30 damage but that's the only thing you really have to worry about with him so as you can see here it makes things pretty hard when you can't even really see where the guy is on top of that you don't even spawn with enough ammo to actually kill the guy so the best way to get this boss defeated is really just to wait until you see somebody else defeat the boss what you really need to do is just wait until somebody else cracks the shield on the boss you're gonna see the big blue splash come effect come up just like you would when you crack anyone's shield so when you crack the boss's shield, what you would really want to do is try to start fighting him after his shield is already down because you have to put so many bullets in him to crack his shield that by the time you do, somebody else is going to come and steal the kill from you or just end up killing you in general. So that's the best way to actually go and defeat this boss. So I wish I knew some special trick to in order to actually kill this boss or to make it easier for people, but unfortunately Epic just keeps adding in these challenges that make things really, really impossible for most players to complete because of how many people end up trying to complete this. Now keep in mind guys, this challenge will be live for a few weeks, so if you give it a day or so, it will die down. You could also try going into duos and squads, that might make things a little bit easier for you if you actually have help from teammates to either defend you or to lower the boss's health a bit quicker. But other than that though guys, you're really just going to have to get lucky with this one if you're trying to complete it within the first hour or so. So good luck to everybody out there who is trying to complete this boss. Now if you guys need any additional help or help with any of the other challenges, I have guides for those as well. So be sure to check out the channel and hopefully I'll see you guys there. Peace.